Welcome to Into the Planet. I'm Jill Heinerth. Join me for scuba diving tips, tricks, and exciting expedition files. If you're an underwater videographer, you've probably wondered how we light some of these interesting shots in the overhead environment. Let me walk you through a few shots. In this one, the diver's got a handheld light, but we were also supplementing with some light on the left-hand side of the frame. You want to balance the natural light so you can still see the beautiful light streaming in the cavern or the wreck diving environment. A key light is a light that's on the camera, and it's just pointing forward and illuminating the foreground subtly. Here, when you're really close to something, you may need to use your hand like a diffuser and cup it over top of the light. This diver is carrying a large light in their left hand, and they've still got a primary light in their right hand that they're moving around to illuminate the environment. This diver is lit by a classic backlight. That's a diver following the light and shining a light straight towards the camera, but using the diver's body to uh, block that light. In this case, there's a light in the diver's left hand that's separating them from the wall, as well as that primary light in the right hand that's searching around in some logical motion. Here we've just got light blazing straight ahead and we've turned everything off on the camera and that gives that dark, gloomy kind of interesting feeling. So there's lots of ways to be creative in lighting the underwater environment, especially in an overhead environment. Get creative and experiment and you'll be amazed at the results you'll come up with. <laughs>